One of the hardest things to deconstruct from is the belief in Judgment Day. Many of us grew up with the belief in Judgment Day drilled into our minds. This created a deep-seated fear of eternal punishment. We were also taught to take solace in it because believers like us, the good Christians, were going to go to heaven. We knew our fate, while everyone else would be condemned to eternal damnation. Do you know how arrogant that is? The term itself implies that someone's going to be right and someone's going to be wrong. And it gives you this moral superiority that you carry around with you, as if you are the divine keeper of knowledge. And I know it because I see you in my comments all the time. But when you let go of that belief, it opens yourself up to curiosity, wonder, love, and compassion in a way that high control Christianity never taught us. But it's hard because I don't know how often I would ask myself, what do I believe if I no longer believe what the church taught me? And who am I if I'm not who the church says I am? I will admit we are in such a season of high tension and a lot of it has religious roots. That's making people create a lot of content about the signs that the judgment day is coming. It saddens me because I believe this season is about transcending. We have a choice to point humanity to a new level of compassion, a new level of understanding. But when we hold on to this rigid dogma that convinces us of our moral superiority, humanity just keeps going around that same proverbial mountain. I'm tired of it, aren't you? So for me, deconstructing from the belief of Judgment Day is a necessary step for anyone wanting to break free from that type of fear-based religion. That's how you reclaim your spirituality. Now, if you find this video useful, I have written a book called Deconstructing, Leaving Church, Finding Faith. I know it will help you and it's in pre-order now.